Hello everyone, welcome to Electronics Hub. In this video, I will introduce you Kyle and Proteus, and from next video, we will start the programming. So, we are in Kyle Microvision 5. Firstly, if any project is open here, click on Project tab and hit Close Project. Right now, no project is present, so I'll hit New Microvision Project. I am this Kyle folder. If you want, you can make a separate folder and you can save the project inside it right now I'll save this as video 2 now we have to select the device I'll use P89V51RD2 it has 32 IO lines, 3 timer counter, 9 interrupts 64K plus 8K flash, 1K on chip RAM you can use 8080C51 RD2 you can use any 80 based microcontroller or 8089C51 if you want the exact specifications then you can go for P 80C51 it has same specifications as we have discussed in previous video right now I'll select P89V51RD2 this one hit ok yes copy so this is our target now what we'll do our project is created so this is our target, we'll right click on target then options for target if you want to change your device then you can change from here as well this is target I'll set this to 12 megahertz this is output we need hex file for protest simulation so I'll create the hex file then I'll hit ok now this is for new file open file and save so I have created a new file then I will go on save I mean this Kyle folder I will save this as video2.c now I will click on source group add existing file and I'll select this video to file so whatever program I'll write in video 2c file we'll see output in Kyle and simulation in Proteus so right now after writing code you have to create the hex file and the object files so for that this build tool is present and for debug mode you have to click here so that's it from Kyle part let's consider you have created a hex file now we'll move to Proteus so this is Proteus click on pick devices here P89V51RD2 is not present so we'll go for 80C51 we'll select this microcontroller I'll place it here you can find my protest tutorial series in i button over here ok so all features of 8051 are included in 80C51 so we can use this in protest there is no need to provide external supply to microcontroller so that is the advantage I will double click on it here you can provide the frequency 12 megahertz is present and we will load the hex file from here which was created from Kyle so yeah that's it from Proteus part we will start actual programming and simulation from next video so stay tuned 
link for data sheet of p89 v51 id2 is given in de description of video and hit like and subscribe button to appreciate my work and share this video with your friends thank you